Good YouTube's this is BD Bomb and welcome to my tutorial on the run you just watched. Thank you for watching that by the way. It took me hours to get the way I got. And the primary reason for that is the mist in this map is total BS. Sometimes on parts where you desperately need vision like high landings, um it will be too heavy for you to see anything. Your screen will be completely white and uh, on other reruns of the same exact parts, it will be completely clear. So, um, or mostly clear anyways. So, if you mess up from the mist, you can't see anything, don't worry about it. It's okay, just don't get frustrated, and keep your persistence if you want to beat this map in probably less faults than I did. So, uh, let's begin, shall we? I'm gonna say play and pause on parts of importance, and also for editing purposes. Okay, so, play! Okay, so you go in and pause. Okay, <laughs> I know that was quick, but look at my back tire here. Do you see how it is? Um, how it's above the rock a little bit. It like got bumped up a little bit. Right here is where you need to start leaning back. If you are um for for the bunny hop, if you are using a controller, just full blown lean. I also think you desperately need a controller to do this. So if you're on PC and you don't have a gamepad, get a gamepad, please. And if you're on Xbox, then you're fine. But anyways, so right here, you want to full throttle pull back as hard as you can uh, to set up for the bunny hop. And uh, yeah, so play and pause. Okay, so you saw where I started leaning forward. It was a little bit before the lip, but that's pretty important. Now the flip, the blah, 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 the sorry, the flip here is really important because basically the premise, play, right here, is um this. See my positioning, how I'm sort of slanted. You need to use the Phoenix Evo as well. Um, but your back tire here is going to spring off of that rock, which will launch you over the little barrier here. It's kind of a shortcut I found. Um. But that will launch you to the next part, and that's why the flip is essential. I find I I have found another way to do this without the flip. You just basically sort of bunny hop over that last rock, but that's only worked for me once out of like a million tries. So the flip is the most accurate way, even though it varies in success. Just don't get frustrated because that's going to happen to you a lot in this map if you're trying to get a perfect run, which I could not, clearly. Play! Okay, so you see he's flying, and boom, pause, when I said boom, meant pause on the boom, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm doing that for editing purposes, sorry, but, um, landing on your back tire, on uh, this part, and in the whole map, is really, really important, especially for the parts where you can't see anything, you need to make sure your biker is positioned in a way that he will land on his back tire, so, well, not too much, but just, just perfect, like you would land a regular landing, so that way he doesn't go flipping and you can clear, get your bearings, maybe go forward a little bit slowly, and patience is really important with this too. If you can't see, just move forward really slowly after making sure your biker is stable. Play! So this is a basic hill climb, just taking your time, going quick, slow, and good, and pause! Okay, so this part, you want to get sort of a, you, you'll get a feel for it after your 80th try on this part, but you want to get a roll going and let go after that roll. I sort of push the, um, the stick down a quarter ish and then let go at this part, and that will get you to roll. Then you just want to keep still. And then when you land, don't press anything, because it's... M unless you can see. Once you see, then you just do a, a bunny hop after this down section. But you don't want to really activate the throttle. You do want to lean a bit, but not really while you're falling, unless you're keeping your biker stable and in that back wheel position. Play! Okay, so you see it explodes. I started leaning back, um, which is something that you need to worry about. Then I took my time on this... Okay, we're good. Surprised I didn't fall on this part. 
Okay, so for that part, it's just you gotta go fast, bunny hop a little bit. And then this part's a jerkwad, because I was doing good on my first run, and then that turned. So that's a basic bunny hop as well. Okay, pause! So, for this part, you don't want to go too fast. Um, it's really gentle. You want to slow down on the throttle, like, once on that straight runaway. Just a little bit. Just enough so that you can land on the back part of this rock here. And when you land on the back part of this rock here, you want to make sure that by the time the rock falls, you will sort of be at the last quarter of it. And the reason for this is if you go too fast, you will land on the ramp. And since you are usually blind when you're down there at first, your bike will flip over and there's nothing you can do about it because you can't see. Play! Okay, so you see, went slow and boom! So I was about halfway before the rock fell, so that's good. I almost fell there, but saved myself, and I was happy. So I just sort of basically bunny hopped there, almost fell down because, uh, the mist. And land on your back tire here. This is bunny hop again. There's a lot of bunny hops in this map. Definitely not a medium map, as it says. So for this part, you can just ham, go ham, and hold down the accelerator. Even if you're blind, it's fine. Don't worry about it. You'll be good. And then the ramp will launch you. You want to miss... Okay, so pause. You saw that's where I got my first fault. Um, that part, I actually did go too fast, so retracting my statement about going ham, you can go ham, but once the white part happens, you want to slow down a little bit just because you want to land on the first rock or maybe bunny hop the ramp so you can clear the first rock altogether. Either one, if you want to get super speed run, I don't think you'll have a problem because doing that little shortcut at the beginning cuts down your time. Like, I think I was a bit faster than the first person. I actually, I didn't look at my time, but yeah, either way, play. Okay, so I got frustrated, restarted, and I was good there. So that's a little bit of a basic bunny hop. Okay, so, ah, oh, dead. Okay, let's try this again. It's my second fault. I think I fault once more here and then I'm good or not. Um, let's see. Okay, pause. So. For this part, um, what I did was once I hit that second sort of incline, I full throttled and leaned back all the way, and then that sort of got me fine, because you want to you wanna hit... I, I know I failed on this part, but you want to go as fast as you can so your bike can sort of hit the rock that you came on on the way, which pushes you forward. It's really stupid, but play! Okay, so it's good falling down. Oh, no! And then I missed because of the reasons just stated. So I do it again, and I'm like, this is stupid, and I am totally not restarting again, because this is probably, like, my 500th time restarting this gosh darn map. So you see there, I hit it, did a little front flip, and landed, so that's fine. This is just a basic hill climb with a little jump at the end, so just go quick at the last part, make sure you have your balance. Uh, that rock does something, and then you win. Um, the last part of this was completely blind, because I hadn't actually, uh hadn't actually gotten past the first half before this section, so that's probably why I faulted. I could probably get zero faults on this, but I really don't care to. Um, <laughs> so yeah, that was my tutorial and my run. Second place, as you can see, faults two, time exactly two minutes. I didn't notice that. So, um, yeah, my time actually, or wait, hold up. No, that's for gold. I'm a silly billy. Faults three, my time was one minute and 50 seconds. So I was indeed slower than the person in first, probably because he didn't get any faults. But with the shortcut, um, you should be able to be faster than the guy in first because I didn't watch his replay, but I don't think he did the shortcut thing because I invented that. <laughs> Kind of by accident, too. So, yeah, thank you very, very much for watching, and good luck if you're having problems with this map. Uh, and I will see you all later. Goodbye.